Five ghosts caught on camera. This is gonna be terrifying. I can already feel it in my pants. During the Civil War, the hotel was converted into a hospital for wounded and dying soldiers. Oh my god, that is terrifying. With a history like that, it's not surprising that the hotel is considered a hotbed for paranormal activity. I'm here at the Minger Hotel. I'm ready to see this terrifying That's ghost encounter. Minger. Waiting for Mike. He went across the street to get some playing cards. Because we're just waiting. As one does at a haunted activity. hotel. Leaves your Open wife it. alone. And then and there's another closet. That is pretty paranormal. Two what, closets in a hotel? Awesome. I've actually That's never seen that before. That is pretty paranormal. That's like all there is. Alright, that was our paranormal experience. Oh my god. A knock on the door. Or on the wall. Mike? Hello? Do you believe in ghosts or spirits? No, I don't. I'd love to be proven wrong. What? Oh my god! Uh-uh. Oh my god. Clothes oh on god. the floor! Oh! You've gotta be kidding me. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god. It's the ghost that makes a mess and puts your clothes all over the place. I love the concept of ghosts in general. Without thinking about this, you would imagine a ghost would be some terrifying entity that would try to murder you. But instead, in every one of these ghost so videos, ghost they're like throwing camera, clothes on the floor or opening cabinets. <laughs> like you would think a ghost, if it were real, would be a lot more terrifying and would do some sinister shit. But they always just, like, do the dumbest thing ever. What the f*** was that? that man thought... was creepy, dog. I was like, what the f*** was that? First, a spray can seems to be thrown at Dana. He thinks it's a little strange, but otherwise doesn't really pay it much mind. Yeah, that was just kind of weird. probably just happened to fall from the decaying ceiling rafters. Whoa! Suddenly a satellite dish comes crashing <laughs> down at a spot where Dana had just been standing. He decides that's enough. A satellite and dish. Quick. <laughs> the ghost couldn't think it'd conjure up anything else. He's like, I can only conjure up a satellite dish. I was genuinely freaked out at that moment in my life. So yeah, that was pretty scary. I don't blame you. On camera, or maybe just a homeless person who's living in the building and trying to scare Dana away. Let me know what you think. Down <laughs> you know what? I really like that theory. That's probably what it is. You've done it again, Nukes Top 5. Odd distortions begin to appear up and down the aisle. No way. That is so weird. A camera with bad quality. I thought every CCTV had those. I like this music too. Get even more bizarre. Holy shit. That is so strange. It just fell on the floor. First a few cans fall, and then a second later even more tumble from the shelf, almost as if pushed. No! Confused shopper comes to take a look. And even a store worker checks in, but they both dismiss the strange occurrence and just walk away. So is this Wait, the store owner saw all that on the floor and just walked away? They didn't even pick it up? That actually does sound like a store owner. <laughs> That's crazy. And strangest of all, footprints all over the walls. Their visit is fairly uneventful until K-pop Dolo sees this. There just can't be a normal ghost. They all have to do some random wacky shit. Like, why is a ghost wearing shoes? 
And then putting the shoes on the wall. door open just the wind thank god <laughs> you may need to get that ghost autograph that sounded like they knew what they were doing they could be very talented around these parts they could be kind of famous closed door opening on its own may not seem very scary but here's where things get truly bizarre yeah, when please explain this to me. Part of the video, K-pop Dolo pans his camera by the exact same door as he is entering the building. The door is wide open. <gasps> so did it close by itself and then reopen again? No. K-pop Dolo was a ghost. claims that neither he or his girlfriend touched the door between the two shots. Many YouTube commenters say that they can see a scary, ghostly face in the door. As he points his camera down the hallway. YouTube commenters are, commenters are also the dumbest people ever. <laughs> but what do you see? So, I don't know about that. Or a real ghost caught on camera? <laughs> this is so dumb. This is so stupid. I swear to God. Why am I watching this? What would make you believe in ghosts? The easy explanation would be that the stretcher is <laughs> anything that can't be explained by something else. Except the stretcher moves in multiple directions, back and forth and to the side. <laughs> oh my god. This is ridiculous. As the stretcher suddenly moves, the morgue worker jumps back and just decides to get out of there. Or is it just a prank or a hoax? Let me know what you think down in the it's comments. It's probably a goblin. Three teenagers decided to film a comedic parody of the television show Ghost Hunters in an abandoned county prison. The video uploader mentions that he and his friends were just goofing around and didn't expect to catch anything on camera. <laughs> Alright, so we're in the phase of the investigation now where everybody breaks off in their own little areas with, you know, a handy cam and we're... Just sort of this looks like the face of a guy who would never pull a prank. And, uh, hopefully, you know, each one of us finds our own evidence and our own personal stories. Just sort of check this looks out. like a real sort of ghost hunter out. right here. Alright, what, what the fuck like could there possibly be? A ghostly face can be seen peering through one of the windows of a holding cell. The scary face seems to be staring directly at the teen as he passes by. It's gotta be the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Video poster mentioned that all of the holding cell doors in the abandoned prison were locked, so no one could have gotten inside. Other so than his like five fucking friends he already talked about. Very bizarre. What the hell? Oh, dude, it's pushing it down. Dude, oh that's crazy. God. What the hell? <laughs> dude, I want to run so bad right now, but I can't. I gotta film this. Exactly. You have to get that YouTube content. Are you pushing it to me? Even if there's a ghost it's pushing crazy. a ball in front of you and you what? can see the paranormal activity, okay, you gotta right, get that okay, YouTube stop. content. It doesn't matter if you die right oh there as long as you God, get the video man. out. I Giving him goosebumps. Yeah. I would get oh goosebumps God. too. Got thrown at me. After I made my YouTube video, Look at my of course. Goosebumps, guys. Look at my goosebumps. Maybe this adds on to the YouTube Dude, video. I have the biggest goosebumps. I'm not making this up at all. Like this is freaking me the hell. Ow. Yeah, that's terrifying. Cellar dweller. <laughs> Two girls are Jesus. alone at home late one night when they hear strange Jesus noises Christ. from their basement. Let's see the cellar dweller. These names. Oh my gosh. It's really cold. What is that? Where's the cellar dweller? What? I, I don't even know what just happened. Now, the girls' reactions in the video seem pretty legit. But so there's they nothing were there. Very scared or that was some pretty good acting. What? Are you trying to tell me that's like some big ass face? 
But this all could have just been a prank being pulled on them. Yeah, what the fuck that is that? Ghost on camera could just be their big brother and What is that supposed to be? Let me know what you think down in the comments. A balloon was following him. This is a pretty unique story. <laughs> What the fuck do you think a balloon is going to do to you? Like, actually. Feeling a bit creeped out, the two go into a room to avoid the creepy balloon. <laughs> but soon, this. Yeah, what does the balloon do next? Oh my god, it's coming! It's coming in the room! We've all seen old helium balloons just sort of float. And they died. But this might be the first time I've seen one. After the video ended, they died. The balloon killed them. And into a room. But you decide. Is this a ghost caught on camera? Yes. Or just a balloon floating around on a very odd. That's clearly a ghost holding a balloon. Like, come on, we've seen a billion of those. Jesus, calm down. What could it possibly be? Quickly, get the YouTube content. We need to see what's going on. Ah. The telecommunications interrupting ghost. You to ruin your connection. And make your vi video quality worse. That's what I would do if I was a ghost. Just make your video glitchy and make static noise. <laughs> come on. Like, come on. Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about, crazy lady. There's clearly nothing up there. She sees a ghost and kind of ends up just scaring herself. A YouTube user says that she was watching. That's like all these videos. This is the dumbest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> the Snapchat filter ghost. Oh, it's right there. That ghost really likes the filter. Oh my god. It always seems to be right in front of her. Like the exact same pace. Every time. Jesus, is it really that scary? That was a nice little bonus funny clip, Nuke. Stop. <laughs>